want you kids, I want all of you to stand yeah, behind here, okay? Yeah. Now, the reason for that is I don't want these guys reaching in and getting a hold of you, okay? Because they're not, they don't want to hurt you, but um, you're feeding them, so they're going to start looking at your hands as being full of fish. So as long as you stay behind here, big throws over the over the trolley, you're laughing, you can go around that side if you like. Sure. Um, that you'll be fine, you know, you can do the throws. <laughs> Why, why do they shake their wings like that? Um, they're excited. Like I said, they're coming into season, so they're doing a bit of, you know, not me. Like a dance thing. Like me. Yeah, yeah. Um, they'll get that skin under their beak. Um, it's called a goiter. Funny name. They'll actually wattle it back and forward as well when they're fully, you know, look at me. Um, it's also aeration. Mm. Get a bit of, you know, it's pretty humid. Well, it's lovely now with that breeze. But, yeah. Um, yeah. So, all right. Now, guys. Yeah. You can have that tongue. Right. That's your tongue. That's your tongue. That's your tongue. You're going to have to come in. Here you go. Do you see? That's your tongue. Um, I'll move back a bit. Hmm? Sorry, guys. Sorry, a bit, a bit whiffy too. I've got um, deep heat on. If you can notice that smell. Full muscle. All right. Now, big throws out there, guys. Okay, now if you drop a fish, I will pick it off. I've got sticks on. I do not want to see anyone pick the fish up. Okay, so I'm going to pick it up. Okay, that's your tongue. Yeah. Okay, now I'm going to pick it up. Okay, that's your tongue. Yeah. Okay, now I'm going to pick it up. Okay, that's your tongue. Yeah. Okay, now I'm going to pick it up. Okay, that's your tongue. Yeah. Okay, now I'm Can you leave it? Leave it. Go in that one. Okay. And leave me about 15 fish in the bottom there Ooh. because I um. Don't need to. So I just had a lady ask me what. Leave it, please. Leave okay. it. Leave it. <laughs> please do not pick up off the ground. Just out of the bucket. Um. The reason why these guys don't go anywhere, they can, but they don't want to because we feed them every mm -hmm. morning, which is, um, um, and there's plenty of tackle in the water as well, okay? so they don't need to go anywhere. All the pellets wants in life is water and food. Yeah. Now if there's an abundance of that, they will breed as well, which is why ours do. Mm -hmm. Is the same, mate? No, I don't think so. No. Oh, sorry. I don't think they do. No. See, I'm not quite sure, but I don't think they do. They say three months. Yeah, 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 they like what you do down south. Um, I think it's in Auburn, isn't it? Are these a family? No, they're not really like them. So when they're green, they come back, Jake. Yep, particularly females. Haha. Snatch them out of the air. I'm not sure that both male and female actually rear them. Do? They're about three months old. And still hang around and, and uh, scab off mum and dad as much as they can, but slowly they get pushed out. And they're really fairly dramatic in the wild. Not And where do they nest? Fish are saving in the middle. In the wild, they are um, very secluded now. Not quite very cunning, not quite very happy. Some sort of, you know, will bring their babies in when they're about three months. Um, oh, our lives go right up the back, we have to actually go to the country to make the country the nest. And at the moment we're not letting them breed. Um, so we're actually putting those eggs. Uh, Jacoba, you can't even cut your feet. Usually only one will come through. Um, because the biggest is the biggest one. Your chain is 
Would you like me to unhook that for you? Hold on, hold on, hold on. There we go. Oh, oh, big one. Two? Oh, yeah. oh, oh, almost. Have we got about 15 fish left? Malia. No, no there's Malia. You've got a huge amount in there. Okay. Malia. What's the Malia? You could just chuck the bucket. Uh, 1025. Okay, you have to call it a fish Malia? now. Um, if you want to go to the right oh, there presentation, um, which I'm presuming most of you will. Um, you can head back to the monsoon forest and catch the train from there. We'll be there in about 10 minutes. So it um, takes you about five minutes to walk there. Then you have a toilet right there. And the water fountain. And then the last one you can see is about an hour and a half to hours. So if the kids and that, you want to utilize them.